never clogged the toilet before, so I didn't know what I was supposed to do. My toilet is funny. And there's water everywhere. I don't know what to do. Somebody help me. Help! Let's rewind a little bit. Hi, and welcome to my channel. I'm Alley Cat, and if you don't like people talking about poop, floods, or black girls, me, then I advise you leave this video right now. I'll give you five seconds. Now that they're gone, you really have to bear with me with this because um, my light broke the other day, so I'm like outside trying to get that natural light, but it's not working too well. But as long as you can hear me, because this is a story time. All right, so this day began as like one of the best days ever, okay? I woke up refreshed and everything without my alarm. You know, I woke up on my own, so that's always good. And I was ready to start the day. Took a shower, washed up, brushed my teeth, did my makeup, and my makeup was looking on point, by the way, as I may add. And I was feeling good. So I thought to myself, why not be productive? and do some shit. Literally, but let's get to that part later. So anyways, I decided to go to Target and get a bike for a vine and also go to the post office to get a money order because my Jeep was coming today and I had to pay them. And I was really excited about my Jeep, which made this day also the very best day of my life. I was like so ready to have my car and be able to drive and not use Ubers every five seconds. So it was a good day. So I went to Target, got a bike. I got a beanbag chair for the house because why not? Why not? And I got some other things and I was like, yes, shopping. And when I came home, I posted a tweet of me and Chad singing I Know What You Did Last Summer by Camila Cabello and Shawn Mendes. So yeah, I posted that tweet of us singing and Camila saw it and she tweeted me back and I was freaking out about it. I like fangirled, ran around the house, was like so excited and added to the best day of my life, you know? I was like, oh my God, Camila saw me sing and said that she loved it. Like, this is great. What could be better than this? I decided why not post a Snapchat of me saying that this day was one of the best days ever. Today is a great day. But then I remembered that I had to go to Best Buy to get a light, which I did not do, and you'll find out why. So my roommates, Brandon and James, were sitting on the couch. They're both boys, please remember that. And I asked them if they wanted to come with me to Best Buy right after I pooped. Yes, I said that. They were like, eh, we might, we might. So I was like, okay, well, after I get out of the bathroom, you know, make your decision so we can go. So I go to the bathroom, I'm taking care of business, watching Vines, scrolling through everything, you know, just, just doing my own thing. This is my private time on the toilet, okay? So I was just doing my thing. So when I flushed it, it made the weirdest sound. It was like, <laughs> And I looked around, I was like, uh, what's going on? And instead of the water going down, it started to come up. And I was like, what? What's going on? What do I do? So I kind of just sat there for a minute trying to figure out what I should do. And then the water started to actually overflow and come out of the toilet and go in on the floor. And I'm sitting there like freaking out like, I cannot tell James and Brandon this because this is embarrassing, one. And two, I don't want to. So I tried to like fix it myself. So. <laughs> I am stupid and I tried to close the toilet bowl, the toilet lid and I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, they can't know about this. But you know, the water was still going and I was like, okay, I have to tell them. So I ran out, like I was screaming and I ran out and I was like, guys, the toilet is flooding and the water's going everywhere. And then, you know what, just watch the clips. My toilet is funny. And there's water everywhere and I don't know what to do. Somebody help me. Help! <laughs> <laughs> Shit! <laughs> I like the toilet. Oh my god, it's going to my room. <laughs> There's shit in it, look. Ah! <laughs> what do I've you do? I've never had the toilet flood ever in my life. Yay for house floods. And then, I was pooping, watching vines, enjoying my business. Flush the toilet, the water went up. So pretty much there was like three inches of water like on the ground in the kitchen, in the bathroom, and it went slightly into my room and into Brandon's. It didn't reach James because he's like across the way. But there was water everywhere. I was embarrassed. I was shocked. I didn't know what to do. I was calling everyone like, what do I do about this water everywhere? They're like, turn the little knob next to the toilet. I wish I would have known that earlier because as soon as I turned it, it, it went off immediately. So I was like, oh. So next, James called the plumber. After we got the water to go off and everything, James called the plumber and they were like, yeah, we'll be here, you know, by six, you know. We waited for this plumber to come. He ended up not coming until late, late, late. So we're like, okay. He finally arrives, he does his work, and then he like opens the back of the toilet and he's like, here's your problem. And we're like, what? And he's like, he holds up the little, What's it called? The little toilet paper roll, like the cardboard part. He holds that up. He's like, someone put.
put this in the back of the toilet for some reason. And I was like, who would do that? Like, we never did that, you know? Maybe it was the people who moved in here before us. I don't know. But that was the whole reason. So it wasn't just my poop, y'all. But I do not clog toilets. We're really close, so I thought I'd share that really embarrassing story with you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, put a thumbs up. If you did not, don't be putting no thumbs down on my videos. And if you liked story times and stuff like that, let me know by liking this video and sharing it with your friends. You know that. So I know. And if you're cool, go like me on Facebook, www.facebook.com slash alleycat, where I upload behind the scenes giveaways and other cool things. Go check it out. And go add me on Snapchat, where you can see like behind the scenes and funny things about my life, like the toilet flooding and other weird things that happen to me. So have a great day in the name of the Lord, and may God bless your every step. And now it's time for Kitten of the Week. This week's Kitten of the Week is Espinoza XX Gucci, aka Valentina. You are my Kitten of the Week. I will be in the DMs. And if you want to be Kitten of the Week next week, here's a link below to find out how. I don't understand the English language. Well, I do, but you know what I mean.